All right, guys, so we're out in the Avenger today. Um, we're gonna uh, go get some fuel, as you can see. I, uh, I'm running a little low. I have uh, my buddy here from Boston, as Alex, and Eli is behind me in the uh, fastest GTR, this side, GTI, I'm sorry, this side of the Mississippi. So he's with us. Um, we're gonna get some fuel and we're gonna talk a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna do some vlogs, some more vlogs, and maybe I'll do it around things like motivation and you know perseverance and things uh, uh, for success. So if you guys want to hear me talk about my my theories, by no means you know gospel, but how I think about things. If you guys are interested, let me know, and uh, we'll try to put some of these uh, videos together. Um, but that is one of my motivations, right, Alex? Oh, oh yeah. All right. So uh, we're going to show you a couple of things that we're doing today. We're going to fly a drone, and I'll show you some preview footage of uh, what some of our upcoming videos will look like. Uh, and so give me feedback, share it with your friends, and uh, let's get this channel going more. Okay, guys? Okay, guys. Well. We're now refueled, and let's get this baby going. We're in sport, and uh, we're gonna go fly some drones. Put it in manual, always drive in manual. Get the uh, e-brake off, which is right there. And because my steering wheel is Alcantara, I try to protect it a little bit. These are uh, mountain bikers gloves. I've got a uh, sort of suede Alcantara uh, grip so that's what I kind of do so if you see me uh, rolling around it's not I'm not wearing garden gloves I actually have a new new pair coming in but uh, you know, these are the sort of stuff you do to enjoy the car so now we're off and we're gonna raise the front end here a little bit and uh, roll on out ah a 435 beautiful car Go ahead and lower the front end and we do that by pushing that button and we're rolling again there it is we're now down downshift oh. it never gets old never gets old alex is in love he I, loves this I'm thing. Have one of these one day. Oh yeah, that's, for sure. that's exactly right. And uh, it's a little overcast, but intermittently I don't think it's going to rain. We've got the top down, which is really the only way to roll in this car. So. You know, we started talking about uh, motivation. So this is a different view, right? So, and like anything else in life, it's really your point of view. Actually, here's Eli. You met Alex before because he was riding next to me. But what do you guys think? What's your motivation? Let's hear about it and let's tell me what you think about it and how, uh, how do you, mo you motivate yourself to kind of achieve your goals and I'm gonna start this as a maybe as a new feature we'll choose a topic and we'll talk about it online and uh, hopefully you know it'll uh, give us some ideas and uh, it'll be a good forum for us to to start engaging more people in in kind of achieving their goals and taking the steps that's necessary so you saw us looking at the car from one uh, perspective earlier you were behind the wheel and here we are, you know, 30 feet, 20 feet up above it, looking at it. So what do you guys think? And uh, what do you think his motivation is? Um, Tell us about it. I think the biggest thing that motivates me isn't necessarily what other people think, but at the same time, it's what other people think. So you're right. It's not what other people think. It's what you think and what yeah. you want to do, yeah. right? I mean, to a point... Uh, what others are going to think of my actions does influence my actions, but I feel like at the end of the day, what motivates someone is, it depends on the person really. Yeah, like, what drives them? You know, so, 
it, 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 sure, what other people think, especially if you trust them, yeah. uh, should help influence your thinking. But all too often, too many people never pursue their dreams or their goals because one, the people that they surround themselves with kind of dissuade them mm -hmm. for one, whatever reason. And, and you should never take, my philosophy is, the words can't should never be in your vocabulary. And if anybody tells you something you can't do and then you're committed to doing it, those people you should completely ignore and pursue okay. it. There, there are so many people that never achieve their dreams because somebody told them they couldn't do it. Exactly. And then they live a life of rec regret. You know, could I, could I, should I have done that? What do you think, Alex? Well, I kind of agree with what, what uh, Eli said. You know, I wouldn't not, you know, if I, my motivation isn't really based on what others, you know, tell me to do. If, you know, someone's telling me not to do something and saying, oh, I, you know, you shouldn't do that for whatever reason. You know, if I think it's right and I have, you know, it's with reasonable doubt that it's going to be a great choice, then, yeah. you know, that's what really motivates me is just to, you know, I mean, at least me personally, yeah. you know, I love to have Yeah. Necessarily speaking. Yeah. They're great. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody is ever going to say I don't want them. Yeah, or most yeah. people <laughs> will not deny them. Exactly. But it should never really be happiness the thing. The happiness doesn't depend yeah. on. I'm just too curious. What's the deal with the uh, Lam Lamborghini? Yep, it is. Are you guys doing a, like a project? Or uh, we are. In fact, uh, nice in fact, we are actually yeah. talking about. We have a YouTube channel. We're sort of vlogging here a little bit, and so we're talking about motivation and things that motivate you. So, what do you think? What would motivate you? We were just talking about, uh, certainly it's not necessarily materialistic things because it right. doesn't bring you happiness, but, you know, what happens, what do you do when somebody says, you can't do these things? Oh, that's interesting. Give me a, give me a, a bit to think about. <laughs> oh, that's wild. Yeah. So you're doing a photographic essay using the Exactly. As a, Is as a... School project by any chance, or? That's... His card. Oh, okay. Wonderful. So you can find it on YouTube. Oh, wonderful. So do you have a um, a uh, location here in Pittsburgh? To yes. Sell the yeah. automobiles? Yeah. Yeah. Well, not do it. We don't. They don't sell these. Unfortunately, okay. they don't sell them around here. Mm -hmm. But uh, we sort of you have to import them. Literally, not only do you import mm -hmm. them from Italy, but mm -hmm. um, if you their nearest dealership is is either in Columbus or Philadelphia. Um, so. Beautiful vehicle. Oh, thank you. What motivates you? Boy, oh boy. Someone says you can't do that. What motivates you to to, to essentially ignore them and go on? What is it? Is it that is there there an inner sense that says you know what? Yes, I can do this. Or do you look to the friends? Ch the challenge aspect. The challenge. Like yes. It's almost it's like, like an, there's a, there's a sense of arrogance to me. How dare you tell me I can't I, do what that. I what I can and sense? cannot do? Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. Hey, I'm 53. I'm like, oh, <laughs> hey, you guys are young. Cool. Um, these people over here, like this woman in the green here. Yeah. She's she's an architect. Yeah. We're beekeepers. We learn to know her through beekeeping. And, you know the whole environmental kind of yes. issues and whatnot. Is, yeah. it, it's one of those things that sort of challenges me. Is like, me why can't you do things why differently and right? And yeah. why do you always have to do them the same way? It's really more like a personal arrogance. Now. Yeah. How dare you tell me? Yeah, I know it's for success in another vlog, but it is. People are afraid of failure, and I always argue that failure is actually essential to success. I've it is key. Yes. What you failed? failed. Like exactly. Kleiner Perkins is that's their big Exactly. You failed at. How do you, yeah. and what because the difference between somebody who succeeds yep. and those that fail are is really what you do with that failure. If you pick yourself up and say, you know what, I still believe in this, I'm going to do it, and you find another way. Right. Those are the folks that really get ahead. If yeah. what you do is walk away at that first failure, right. you're doomed yeah, to I never find success. To be I think the biggest motivation is... Okay. I think as far as motivation goes, uh, 
my biggest motivation is not necessarily an actual motivation, but I like getting things done. Yeah. And I don't like leaving things half like halfway, half assed. Like I, it needs to be done. It and needs then, to be done. Like you were saying with yeah. failure, you know, the failure just motivates me to come back and come back and do it again until it gets done. Until it gets right, yeah. That's awesome. So guys, uh, this is a little long on the longer side. It's probably about seven minutes or so, but um, tell me what you think about this, uh, this format. Um, we can use it to talk about a lot of different things. Um, you can suggest topics uh, and let's go from there. But there is uh, the Aventador. Skies uh, kind of got a little uh, more overcast and we had a little bit of uh, uh, drizzle. So we put the top back on. Uh, we're still going to go see if we can uh, fly the drone, but uh, tell me what you think if you like this format and we'll do more of them, okay? Take care. Be sure to like and uh, subscribe and even better, share it with your friends and let's get this conversation going, okay? Thanks again, Alex and Eli, for helping me out on uh, uh, this video. Please take a look at Ignition Tube. I'm going to put the link in the description below. You're going to see an awful lot of great stuff on that second channel and actually uh, Alex, Sam and Eli are going to be working on that channel. They did some great Sam work. Too. And yeah, I said Sam. Sam uh, they did Sam the shout out. Exactly. Sam, we miss you, buddy. You should have been here. Yeah, he's in California. I he's know. Not in the rain. Uh, he's not in the rain, I tell you. So check Ignition Tube out, subscribe and uh, take a look at some awesome stuff there. Thanks guys. Appreciate it. Ciao. <laughs>